Hello everybody. I uh, hope the day finds you well. Okay, I'm today I'm going to show you my very simple, basic line work jack skeleton with um, Halloween coming up and stuff like that. I get asked for this one a lot. Um, there's a lot you can do with this guy that I'm not going to show you. You can put a bow tie on him. He's got the frills that come out. I believe he has a cape. Um, but like I said, this is just simple, basic you know, two, three minute, if that, um, Jack Skellington. He's uh, four balloons, two black, one white, and then a white round. So, let's get started, shall we? So, your first black. You're gonna blow it up quite a bit. You can leave like a, you know, like a palm, whatever. Uh, you're not gonna use all of it. What I do is I come up about, you know, two, three hand lengths. Let's go, one, two, three, let's do three. So three hand lengths, uh, he's very long, very lanky kind of guy. So that's gonna be one arm. Then we're gonna make his two ear twists. Right there. That's where his, the round is gonna go. That's where his head's gonna go. And then don't come down as far as, a little bit less than your arm, come down and then bring it back up. Twist it off. And then you're going to twist this section into a sweet twist. You can honestly just grab it like this and then twist it. Okay, so that's what you got. Now take the arm you already made, bring it up to your other balloon, size it off. That. You can either break it off, cut it. At this point, you probably really, or not cut it, whatever. Do that. That's fine too. I do not have my scissors, so that's what you got so far. Okay. So then, take your other black balloon. Pull it up very close all the way. Again. You want some long legs on him, so I left about the same amount. Go one inch bubble, and then you a flower pepper. So you got a foot, you know, your basic foot. Then you're gonna feed the legs through the body. And again, you want that really long legs. Okay. So then, what I do is I measure off the other leg. So you wrap the uh, the leg into the foot, between the foot and the uh, one inch foot. We got the flower petal. Another one inch bubble, and then hopefully break up the rest. Okay. So this is what you've got so far. Kind of tricky here. You're gonna take these, which you could do prior to this um, when you're making the legs. You have to make two little bring the legs together, make a little bubble. You got both of the legs in that bubble. him because we want him forward. We don't want him, we want him facing this way. Okay, so that's going to stabilize him a little bit. Take your white. Blow it up. I'm a big advocate of showing mistakes on tape because they're going to happen to you. Um, so I'm not going to edit and cut because I messed up. It's just going to, you're going to see it because it's going to happen to you. It happens to me, it happens to everybody. Make a small flower petal. Now we're making the uh, hands. Make a small flower petal. Take your knot and you're so okay to bring it through. Okay? That locks it. Make yourself two small pin twists. So then you've got your basic hand. Okay? 
This is something I, I believe I saw on Scott Kazan's Minion. And then I believe he got it from Chick on Twist. So, make a bubble and make it two pin twists. So now you're going in reverse of what you just did. And wrap this balloon. Turn around those twists a little bit. Break off your white. Tie it. You're gonna need it. Okay. Hold on to that. Just like that. Wrap it tight. Uh, <laughs> grab your wine key, because that's all I got right now. And you're going to pop this bubble right here. You're going to pop that guy. And you're going to lose your balloon. So now you've got your two hands. Connect your hands. The ends of your arms. Like so. You can do that for both of them. Let the dog hair off. Alright, so. Take that remaining white. Into the top or the bottom, doesn't matter. Put that around, take off the excess. And this is what we've got so far. Last but not least, pull up your five inch round. That's your Jack Skellington. And then draw your face. Um, there's a lot of different ways to draw his face. Uh, there's a lot of things on uh, stuff like that. I'm just gonna do it quick. Looks like an alien. Um, I think his biggest feature is his sewed, sewn mouth. Shown sh Really? Sewn shut mouth. Biggest thing. So, yeah. That's my really quick. I know the video's gone for eight minutes and it's really, really long. It's my longest video, I believe. But once you get this down, it's super quick. Um, so, yeah. Hope you guys can use this. Hope you enjoy it. And obviously you can move his arms around and stuff like that, or um, you could you know, put the elbows on there, uh, you could just bend it, however you want to do it, you know, use it, hope it helps you, hope uh, somebody asks for a skeleton, you saw my video, it helps you out in a pinch. Good day.